Hey guys, it's General Heed here. How's everyone doing? Uh, today, for our last glitch video of the year, we are going to show you guys what, uh, <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying this, but what Carter and George look like on the inside in Halo Reach. So basically, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get inside of Carter and George um, in a professional way. But anyways, to do that, what you want to do first is start up on the second rally point of the mission Winter Contingency and just grab a plasma pistol at your earliest convenience. Oh, and I do want to mention, if you haven't noticed, um, this is Halo Reach running on the Xbox One X. Uh, Halo Reach is not an Xbox One X enhanced game, but uh, even games that are not specifically patched or enhanced for Xbox One X, they still get a few benefits uh, visually, like resolutions upscaled and just better uh, anti-tropic filtering and better frame rate, stuff like that. So. Uh, this is basically what Halo Reach looks like on the Xbox One X, upscaled to 4K, and then later downscaled back to 1080p because of Movie Maker. But uh, anyways, I uh, just uh, wanted to mention that so you guys can kind of enjoy Halo Reach and slightly improved visuals. But anyways, what you want to do here is you want to use your plasma pistol. You want to come to this mountain, you want to use the plasma pistol to shoot, to shoot down this Falcon here. Now, a lot of you have commented in previous videos about this method. This is the method used for the time travel glitch as well as uh, speedrun tactics. As you can see, a lot of you mentioned that um, you think it's patched because when you shoot the um, Falcon, the it doesn't fall down. Well, I don't know why it doesn't always fall down, but if it gets stuck up there for you like you just saw there, just shoot it again, and it'll, it'll fall down eventually. Or if it doesn't, then just restart the game. But anyways, uh, what you want to do is you want to basically flip it over so that the pilot falls out, and then you could fly the Falcon yourself. Now what's interesting is that the pilot, I used to think that there was no pilot inside, like it was just invisible, but there actually is a pilot, it's like super super tiny, and you can see here like I can actually swap weapons with the pilot. Um, and you can even kill the pilot too. <clears throat> but you can't really see the pilot, because the pilot's like super like microscopic. Uh, but if you do, you can use grenades to kill the pilot or you can melee the pilot. <laughs> And then if they die, then, well, they die. And if you have allies nearby, they will actually uh, get mad at you and make comments about you, <laughs> negative comments. <laughs> so anyways, what you want to do next is you want to have one person get into the driver's seat of the Falcon. And you want George and Carter to each get into one of the two seats behind the pilot seat. Basically, these two seats right here. And all you gotta do is just simply get into the seats they're sitting in, and you'll be sitting right inside of them. You will get right inside of George and Carter. And it only works on these two seats. Any other seat, and it'll just cause them to uh, get out, or you won't be able to get into the seat at all. But for some reason, these two seats, while George and Carter are sitting in them, they're still valid seats that you can sit in. So, we were just inside of George, now let's switch over and get inside of Carter. Alright, so this is what it looks like inside of Carter. As you can see, you actually can't see through his visor, so <laughs> technically speaking, from our perspective, Carter is actually playing blind the entire time. Well, not playing blind, but he's actually like, he can't see anything through his visor. Uh, maybe that's why Halo AIs are just bad shots sometimes for your allies, because they can't see through their visors. But anyways, uh, this is what it looks like from third person when someone else gets inside of Carter. Uh, as you can see, you pretty much just merge together, uh, and you know it doesn't really affect Carter or anything or George, but you, you get a much better view inside of Carter and George because George is a lot uh, bigger. His your view from inside of George is a lot more obstructed. But anyways, uh, <laughs> what we did for fun here briefly was uh, I did have one of my friends uh, change their armors to match Carter's as closely as possible, and then he would get inside of Carter. And basically, it ends up looking like Carter has uh, two heads, as you can see here. And it's just basically funny, like two-headed Carter. Now, one more thing you could do with this uh, that's also kind of cool is um, the glitch also works in reverse. So if you were to get into the seat first, or if you were to get it into them, if you, if you get George or Carter out and you get into the seats, they the seats are still valid for the AIs. So as you can see... Now you can watch George get inside of you instead of you getting inside of George. And with Carter, same thing. They both behave the same way. 
uh, you can get inside of, you can have Carter get inside of you. I mean, t technically the perspective is all still the same. You're still clipping through each Spartan, but <clears throat> you, um, you just get to watch the little animation of them getting in, and it just seems like weird. It's like they're, they're like intruding on you while you're sitting peacefully. But let's do it with Carter really quickly. So let me sit down, and Carter should momentarily get inside of me. There you go. Now he just gets right inside of you. It's like, you know, excuse me, I was sitting here first, right? <laughs> Now, uh, as far as I remember, these are the only members of Noble Team available on this part of the mission. So, you won't be able to do this with Emil or a cat. Uh, but if I'm mistaken, then, and you can get Emil or a cat into uh, the Falcon on this mission, then you could also get inside a cat or a meal. But I think it only works on this particular Falcon. I don't think you can do it with just any Falcon. But I haven't fully tried that out yet. But if anybody does try it, just uh, let me know your results. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys can enjoy that. That was our last uh, glitch video for this year. Uh, next year we'll be back with more, of course. Uh, but other than that, uh, if you guys enjoyed this, make sure to leave a like. And leave your thoughts and comments. Anything I'm going to check out next year, just uh, let me know. But other than that, make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, also click the little no notification button next to the subscribe button. So that you can stay up to date with our latest videos. Uh, but, you know, if you've done that, then uh, great, and I will see you guys next time.